How do you know whether your current diet is causing oxidative stress? In this video, you'll learn how to use a urine test kit to measure oxidative stress. I'm Peter Stroot, the founder of Glixen, and I started this YouTube channel for people with chronic health conditions looking for answers. Subscribe and check the notification bell to make sure that you receive my latest videos on how to improve your health for peak life. Most people start a new diet with the goal of losing weight. What if that's the wrong goal and instead you should be focusing on oxidative stress? There are many types of oxidative stress, but blood oxidative stress or BLOS is probably the most important one when it comes to your health. Now, blood oxidative stress is thought to be caused from a diet rich in organic and inorganic sulfur. How confident are you that your current diet is low in sulfur? A test to measure BLOS is still probably years away. My company, Glixen, is the only one developing a blood test to measure BLOS. While we wait for the blood test, what can we do? Two Blue Diamonds sells a free radical test kit that you could use to measure oxidative stress in urine. This is the little kit from Two Blue Diamonds. It's right here. It's much like your kits that you use for measuring water quality for your pool or for your aquarium tank. Very easy to use. Okay, how do you use this kit? First, first thing in the morning, you want to urinate into a cup. You don't want to do this later in the day. You'll start getting readings all over the place. It's very difficult to, to get a good accurate measurement unless you do it first thing in the morning. So right when you wake up, have everything ready to go in your bathroom, urinate to a small disposable cup, take the little test strip, dip it in the urine for one second, Shake off the excess. You can use uh, toilet paper to dab the excess urine and then just let it sit for three minutes. So I use my phone with a little timer, count down to three minutes. And when you're done, you can evaluate it. Now, how do you evaluate it? You compare your little test strip color to the scale that they provide on the side of the container. Now, what I found is that it's a little bit difficult to use their scale as is, but what I do is I put my test strip next to the scale, and then I take a picture with my smartphone with the flash on. It gets a good white light, good consistent lighting. Take a picture. Here's a picture of my test strip. I'm happy to report that I have low oxidative stress. How about you? Now, if you're thinking about changing your diet, I've offered a lot of links down below for several different diet books that I think will probably lead to low oxidative stress. But you're going to have to get the free radical test kit in order to fully evaluate your dietary changes. Just remember, it's real simple. If you can track it, you can hack it. This free radical test kit gives you the ability to measure your oxidative stress every day if you want. I would probably recommend every other day or every three days to see if you can see a change in your urine oxidative stress. It will probably take a week or two before you see a noticeable difference if the lower your sulfur intake is actually impacting your blood oxidative stress. So be patient, but use the kit. Now my blog site has several BLOSS hack kits. So I've assembled these. They include your free radical test kits, my ebook or book for that BLOSS hack kit, You'll also have a collection of those diet books, same links you have down here below. I have them um, for each one of these BLOSS hack kits. And then I also selected a number of other items that help round out these hack kits. So check those out if you're interested. Now the free radical test kit is offered both through Amazon and through Two Blue Diamonds. Amazon takes about a week right now for shipping. Two Blue Diamonds is a little bit faster. They can get it to you in a few days. So check those out if I added those links down below if you're interested. Here's something else that may interest you. I have a good friend of mine who was recently diagnosed with type 2 diabetes. He's very interested in the free radical test kit. He wants to use it to monitor his diabetes and oxidative stress level when he goes through a dietary change. He's thinking about perhaps a keto friendly type diet, but he wants to actually document the level of oxidative stress right now for about a week, take some measurements, blood glucose, things like that, and then make his change in the diet and then keep monitoring it. What we think might happen is that his oxidative stress may lower due to a dietary change, but he also may see some improvement in his diabetes. What do you think?
Now, if you use the free radical test kit to help you monitor your own dietary change and you see some improvement, I'd love to hear about it. Write your comments down below so that I can read about it, but also other viewers can read about it. Please subscribe and share this channel with any family members or friends that you think may benefit from this information. There's a lot of you out there with oxidative stress, and I'm sure this kit could be the key to helping you lower your oxidative stress and improve your health for peak life.